Here we are in Google Drive. I'll remind you how we got here in case you don't know. Wherever you see the Google Apps icon on the top right of the screen, you can click on it and you can choose any G Suite app. So even if you're in your Gmail account, you can come here and click on Drive from there. The first thing to know about the My Drive and the Shared With Me is that you're not limited to this view. The view I'm looking at here with these small folders at the top and the thumbnails at the bottom is called Grid View. And I can change the view by clicking on the icon up here, which will take me to List View. List View gives you more details. You can see the owner, last modified and the file size. You can see now that the icon has changed to show a grid view. If I click back on that, it will take me back to the view I was looking at and the one I prefer. The next thing to understand is that Google Drive has two separate areas. You have the My Drive, which is the area we're looking at here, and the Shared With Me area. And I'll come back to this one in a moment. My Drive is an area that you control. It's somewhere that you can create documents and somewhere that you can create folders and you can store them in any way you prefer. The Shared With Me area is very different. This is like a holding pen. It's an area where people share things to you that they think you want, and sometimes you will want them, and sometimes you won't. You can't put anything in folders in this Shared With Me area. So if you want to store things in a way that makes sense to you, you need to move documents from the Shared With Me into the My Drive. If there are documents that you just need to use for a short time, just once, to complete a piece of information, you can leave them in the Shared With Me area. If, however, you're going to reuse it or use it regularly, I suggest you put it into the My Drive. Let's look at how to move a document from the Shared With Me to the My Drive. If I roll my cursor over a document and click once, you should see that I now have a new set of tools. And the icon up here is telling me I can add to my drive. If I click once and click on organize, I can tell it which folder to go into. Or I can make a new folder here. So let's pop it in a folder called GI Admin and click on move. When I go back to my my drive and open the folder, I should see the document is now in the folder I chose. But it's really, really important to remember that it's also still in the shared with me area. It hasn't moved it. It also hasn't made a copy. It's the same document. You're just seeing it in two different places. The reason this is so important is if you delete one, you delete both. So please just leave the documents in the shared with me area. Eventually they'll just move down out of sight. But when you want to find them again, you pick them up from the My Drive. Understanding the way My Drive and Shared with Me works is the first step to working really efficiently in Google Drive.